Guess who? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we are here um, for the cat adoption day at Pet Supermarket and we're gonna be seeing the five kittens that we transported here from the veterinary hospital the other day. So we are hoping that they can um, get adopted today. Maybe some have already. Yay! Are we gonna go see the kittens? You want this? Are we gonna go see the kittens? Yeah. Yeah! Say much. <laughs> it's whisper. Okay, okay, honey. Oh. Mm. Oh, I got you. Oh. I thought I had like a cold. <laughs> it doesn't. It's like so natural. Wow. Wow, you're amazing, Ashley. You are. There we go. So what can people do if they come across a feral cat in their yard? What What is the best advice for somebody? If there is, I guess, a cat outside, it's totally up to you and your situation, your circumstances, if you want to feed them, if you want to see if they have the ear tip. Um, because typically if they have the ear tip, it means that they've already been fixed and vaccinated. We get with a rescue group or um, if not a rescue group like your local Humane Society, a lot of them do offer TNR services where all of the ferals in your backyard would be able to get um, sterilized, get vaccinated against rabies, get all of their important shots and everything, and then get put back outside. That way we're kind of curbing the repopulation thing while still letting them. If you do end up finding kittens in your yard, if they are young, if they are little, leave them where they are, keep an eye on them. There's a very good chance mom just left him there because she feels that they are safe and she's out hunting she will most likely be back for them definitely definitely keep an eye on the babies um don't just leave them out there and go about whatever you're doing but you don't really want to touch them either um, now if mom doesn't return you definitely want to call a local rescue call a nonprofit. we do so cute look at you you are so cute oh, you, look at your face Oh, I'm gonna find you a home. 